If Lady Marjorie wrote a letter. No. Don't push it. It's probably I'm done. Sorry, Roderick. Sir Maynard, you are here. Plus, you don't have the seal anyway, so it wouldn't work. Mira, Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Sir Maynard. Oh, the man's breath smells like a brew house. I was hoping I'd catch you at something slightly more exciting. A love letter, perhaps? Or a declaration of war? I know you're very busy with Lady Marjorie and... and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. If you don't mind, go ahead then. That is well, not the tone I meant. It's... We really should get these letters sent first. Do you need any help with I've those? I've got them. I was not. I just meant like, oh, go ahead. What What does he want to say? Not go ahead. Fine. Whatever. Bloody cold today, isn't it? <laughs> Seems to keep getting colder. Say it's bloody cold like it isn't going to be one day. Oh, wow. Oi, fuckhead. You might be new here, but you're in my spot. So move. I think we'll get along fine. It's just Most a spot. Of you will be dead I'm going to be standing the there no matter what. Frostfinger and his bloody speeches. If you want to survive in the night's watch, listen close. You know why I got sent to the wall? You raped someone? The wall was erected over 8,000 years ago to defend the realm from wildlings. White At this girl I used to fuck now and again. Face like a queen, tits like a whore. Turned out she was married to some lordling. He tried to stick me with this. Nice dagger. I was stuck in him instead. Shut up for once, will you? What's your problem? I'm sick of Finn bragging about all the girls he's fucked. And what diacrime are you here for? Fucking potatoes. <laughs> potatoes? You? Potato. I couldn't help it. No, <laughs> I stole them. That's what got me sent to the wall. I couldn't help it. Nobody cares, thief. Don't call me that. My name's Cutter. Cutter the potato fucker. There's one for the songs. Oh, sorry, bro. Boy, my sister was hungry. I've got something for your sister. Will you stop arguing. Who in seven hells is talking back there? And I'm gonna be the one that's yelled at. Total. Who was it? Sorry, sir. It was my fault. Covering for your new brothers already, are you? Garrett Total here wants to be a ranger. So we can go north of the wall and die on some wildling spear. But what he wants doesn't mean shit. No, of course not. So today you're all gonna show me what you're made of. Can you swing a sword? Shoot a bow? Are you strong? Those who do well might just survive. The rest of you. Frostfinger. Oh, there's Sean. I need to work. Wow, they made you pretty. What just happened? Go on, get started. Best of luck, Tuttle. Hmm. Whatever. No! Here we go. Again. Bows up! See those dummies? Those are fens. Come to eat your brains for breakfast. Just a chance there. Good castle Black. Castle Black. Demonstrate your combat skills? So this is home now. Okay, well. I wanna go pet the horse, or are they gonna yell at me for petting the horse? 
But rangers have horses, so. Okay. That's enough. Yay, horse. <laughs> Um, I don't think we've ever used a crossbow, so... Swords? Take that! Take that! Watch your bloody top! You! Grab a practice sword! Oh gosh, I can pick which sword I want? Uh... This one should do. I'll be sparring with you today. I don't know why. Remember, these blades are dulled, but a sword's still a sword. Good luck. Okay, well, that's fail miserably. <laughs> da, 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 da. Come on, keep at it. There you go. <laughs> Press Q for once at the right time. Don't. Well, four. Don't get cocky. Get off me, you bloody ox! You got lucky. Oh, you know who's watching. Get distracted. Look at. Stop gawking, Tuttle. Okay. Can I go? Nope, it's not going to let me help. The guy's over there, so. Let's learn how to use a crossbow, I guess. You're doing that all wrong. Oh, do we know how to use one? Have these where I- <gasps> Oh! <laughs> Mansurator will shit himself when he sees you coming. <laughs> Let me show you. Uh, he just shot himself in the foot and you're just like, yeah, let me show you. All right, let's see if you can aim worth a wildling's ass. Shoot the targets, I tell you to. Oh no. Let's start easy. Middle dummy, center of the chest. You can follow orders at least. Next bolt, left target, head. What if I just shot him? Good. <laughs> right target, chest. Um. There we go. Apparently, I clicked outside Not the window. Bad. Center between the eyes. One less wildling. Did I accidentally stop you anything? All of them. Nicely done. No, I didn't accidentally stop that dusty. Or dusty, not dusty. Yeah, we should kind of worry about his foot. Cause, you know, he did just shoot himself in the foot. Finn thinks he's so bloody clever. If a real wildling got his hands on him... Ah, he's just a bully. Aye, he is. That's why I took this. Oh. Swiped it right off him. How did you get don't caught tell, stealing right. potatoes if you can take them? I don't think he'd take it kindly. I won't tell anyone. I knew I could trust you. Okay. What now? Can I go help those people, like, carry the... Yeah, can I help with this? You there, recruit. Scrawny, aren't you? They're See if all you right. can carry one of these barrels over to the winch. Okay. Right. I can do this. Want some help? 
Ah, of course. Alright, gonna need to take some work, but we got this. Don't drop it on his foot. Don't drop it on your own foot. There we go. Don't hurt yourself, Tuffle. You can play the strength. Oh, that was a challenge. I'm thinking steward for you. You can help Frostfinger wash his cock. If the thing isn't frozen off. I oh, don't. He wants you to say something. Not <laughs> bad. I love that. <laughs> Just no. That's not. That was perfect. You're pathetic. Fuck off. You didn't even try. A crossbow's a coward's weapon. Besides, I could hit that dummy from here with my. Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? If someone has it, I'll cut their fucking balls off. Mm. You figure it out Come yourself. To think of it. You were the last one I showed it to. Well, you and it was you. What? You little fucking thief. It weren't me. Finn, don't. <gasps> Give me my knife. I don't have it. Could you swear. just hide behind my me? way? Got it. Do something. Just calm down. Fight. Oh. Yep. Okay. I won't say it again. <laughs> that wasn't the very nice. Aside. <laughs> that wasn't very nice. <laughs> now about this. Oh. Uh, that was nice. Oh. Hey, look. Fight. Fight. Yeah, get it. Here they go again. <laughs> What? There we go. Get off! What is going on here? He stole my fucking knife! No, I didn't. And Garrett defended him. The last thief I caught no longer has hands. I swear I don't have it. Good job on stashing. Did you stash it? You must have hid it. You stashed it on me. And you. I expected better, Tuttle. Instead, I find you doing this on your first bloody day of training. You clearly need a few days scrubbing the latrines. Frostfinger, I need another man to top the wall. Fine. Let him freeze his balls off. <laughs> I'll what? deal with this one. <laughs> Get off! Oh! Mind your fucking manners. He needs that. You, come with me. Don't worry, I don't think your boss will actually fr freeze off with just one trip up there. He stashed a knife on me, didn't he? Hope he just hid it behind the barrel, not on me. <laughs> oh! This way. Hmm. I love King's Landing in the afternoon. The sun just barely kisses your skin. Okay, I need to be more happy you with her. You used to love this place. Remember, we'd come listen to the musicians in the evening with Lady Marjorie? You're right. It's beautiful here. Just through here. What are you doing? You'll see. Queen Cersei's finest wine. Where did you get that? I know a boy who keeps the Queen's cellar well stocked. Nobody will miss it, I assure you. Not even cups? A little won't hurt. 
This is gonna be bad, but I need to put her on my good side. <sighs> so, I, uh... Well, I just... Please, go on. I'm not very good at this sort of thing. Listen, if I tell you this, Mira, you must promise to keep it to yourself. You can tell no one. I swear, I won't tell a soul. You're just saying how there was no I will remember My mother that. was a handmaiden to Lady Elena for many years. She became pregnant. It was a disgrace to her family. My true name is Sarah Flowers. You're a bastard? Yes. I'm fortunate to be where I am, I know that. But to always have to hide. What happened to your mother? Lady Elena asked no questions. She took care of my mother. And when I was born, she gave me the name Durwell. My mother died not long after. Who else knows about this? Lady Marjorie, her grandmother, and now you. It's just... I don't want to be Sarah Flowers forever. I need Lady Marjorie to arrange a marriage for me. It's my chance at a life. Did you have someone in mind? Someone you'd wish to marry? I'd have to convince Lady Marjorie to make an introduction first. I know she often confides in you, and I was hoping that maybe sometime when she comes to you wanting to talk, you might suggest she talk to me instead. Give me a chance to win her over. Coming from you, it's sure to mean a lot. I can't make that promise, Sarah. You could if you wanted. It's not that difficult. I have much bigger problems, Sarah. That is not I what I meant. Look out for my family. No, you're right. I'm sure I would want to look after my family too. I know your family's troubles are much greater than mine. With what happened to your brother and your father. Can I have an option to say I will try my best at least? You need this more than I do. Ah, <laughs> Tyrion approves. Hmm. A conspiracy of handmaidens. Lord Tyrion, my lord. Ladies, what have we here? If you mean to drink from that flagon... Care to join us, Lord Tyrion? Hmm. Not the finest arbor red, but a favorite of my sister's. Quite expensive for a handmaiden. I'd be curious to know how you got hold of it. Since I'm certain my sister didn't give it to you, she won't even share with me. Though that's hardly surprising. Why do you always want me to do it? We found it in that bush. Lord Tyrion. That's the dumbest excuse ever. Strange it should find its way into a bush. If Cersei knew you had this wine, she'd drown you in it. You must know what risks are worth taking. Especially if you wish to have an alliance with me. Wait, what? Things have changed. My father has recently taken an interest in Ironwood. Most of the Royal Navy went up in green flames. <laughs> and whose fault was that? It must be rebuilt. He insisted I handle things myself. I'm on my way to meet representatives of Lord Whitehill. Lord Whitehill? He's hired a pair of merchant lords to broker for his house. It would seem Lord Whitehill wishes to sell the ironwood right out from beneath your family. I don't know much about the man, but judging by his up-jumped sellswords, negotiating with him won't be pleasant. I will speak for House Forrester. Perhaps you could. Come with me. These men think I have no choice but to deal with them. 
Imagine their surprise when I bring a forester to the table. It might be the first fun I've had in months. <laughs> you say that a lot. My lady. <laughs> yeah. Really? In a bush? Come on.